Hello, welcome to the Rocks Show Ready iOS tutorial. In this tutorial, we will go through the features of the app and show you how to use them. First, purchase and download the app from iTunes. When you first open the app, you will be asked for the cast username, which is the name of your school or theater, and the cast password or authorization code. Both of these are sent to you in an email from licensing at rightonqservices.com. Enter in the information and press continue. Your show will now download. On the bottom of the screen, you will see song list, marker list, player, mixer, and settings. First, song list. This is where you can see and select the various songs of the show. You can also control the atakas by tapping on the green check mark once to make it a blue arrow. This will segue this song straight into the next. Tap it again to get a red X to skip the song. Tap it a third time to return to the green check mark. In marker list, you can see the various markers for a particular song. The markers have the same title that is listed in the score with the accompanying measure and beat number. You can also create custom markers with the director authorization on your computer. The player has your basic player controls. You have previous song, previous marker, play or pause, next marker or next song. In the middle of the page, you will see the change log. This shows the various edits that have been made to the show, either by default since they are in the score or edits that the director has made to your license. Above that is the status window that shows you various information about where you are in a song. Finally, the playhead allows you to fast forward or rewind in a song. Occasionally, you will come across a song that has a vamp in it. When you enter into a vamp, this blue arrow will appear. To exit the vamp, simply tap on the arrow. A side note about edits. Your device will automatically look for new edits whenever you open up the program. You can also manually look for edits by going to the song list and pressing the update key. In the mixer section, you have the piano, bass, and drum parts, as well as all the individual vocal parts plunked out on the piano. To mute or unmute a part, simply tap on the M. You can do the same thing to solo a part so you only hear that part by tapping on the S. If you wish to mute or unmute all the vocal parts at once, simply double tap on an M. If you wish to change the sound of an instrument or a vocal part, tap the arrow and then select the new sound you wish to hear. You also have the ability to adjust the individual volume levels of the various parts. Simply drag the slider to whatever you want it to be. Finally, in the Settings tab, you have the ability to make temporary edits. You can transpose a song up or down, as well as adjusting the tempo. You also have the ability to adjust the click volume here as well as screen brightness and system volume. This concludes our tutorial on the iOS Show Ready app. Thank you for watching.